This is a short demo of the Lotus Notes connector for Microsoft Online Meetings. This extends your Lotus Notes mail template so that it can create uh, scheduled meetings, uh, online meetings using the Microsoft products. So first let's take a look at the demo. Here we have uh, version 7 of Lotus Notes client and here's the calendar and we're going to create a meeting. So if I just double click on a meeting and I give it a subject and I need to check this box here to make it an online meeting and here I have options for my online meeting I'll just leave those alone I can I can select who's a presenter and I can select who is required and these are all features just built into Lotus Notes nothing special there except for the online meeting and if I scroll down here I can add text description of the meeting and then I can actually send out uh, invitations to uh, attendees. So if I click this button what happens now is that uh, we have created a meeting. Here it is. And if I open up this meeting you'll now will see that there's a link here to the online meeting. There's also a password. If I scroll down you'll see all kinds of text here about the meeting. So this information has been appended to my description. It has things like the phone number, the participant code, um, you know, password, here's information for help if you're having trouble and so on. So all of this information has come from uh, a configuration document that you set up for your notes um, end users. So if we go back to our download page and talk about what exactly do you get. Well, there are two different mail templates available here, version 7 and 8.5, and they have the additional design elements that allow the client to call a REST service. So also in here is the service, the REST service that sits on top of the online meeting APIs that are then exposed by this REST service. Uh, what is calling those is actually some Java agents and there's LotusScript uh, managing the UI. So the, the way you do that, deploy this is by simple replication. There are no DLLs to, uh, to worry about. If we look at the settings inside of the Notes client, if I go up here as the end user and I say in Lotus Notes my actions, MS Live Meeting, I can look at my logon credentials and here where it says the server URL, this is to the REST service. So this hides for me as an end user what kind of service, what version of OCS is being exposed. I don't really know or care. I just have the URL that points me to that REST service and of course I have a username and password and a domain. I also can set the body profile template. Here's where this text is. I just type in this text down here inside of this rich text field and up here are some variables I can use. So the username, the, the meeting URL, conference ID, those things get stuck in there automatically. So this can be configured either through the replication or by the end user themselves. Additionally there are some test agents and things in here. I can get the current version, I can retrieve uh, meeting information about this live meeting and so on. And there's some, ad some other additional elements uh, in the template about this. So this is actually a very simple add-in in that it doesn't require you to deploy any DLLs. It does require you to set up a service, a REST service in your environment that sits on top of the um, APIs for the online meeting. But basically this is a very simple, very self-supporting environment. However, you can go into the download page where we've created a page here on a Domino server that not only exposes all the documentation for you to look at before you download it. Here's where the download is, but we also have a forum. So you can go in here and you can actually post questions and ask questions and we'll try and respond to those. So I hope you will find that uh, this is an, a useful connector for you and give us some feedback soon. Thank you.